We've all heard the saying, mind over manner. matter. A unit at Widener University is teaching patients these days how to use the power of their minds to conquer a variety of health problems. Allie Gorman has the story for us on Health Check at 11. Just take a nice, smooth inhale. Maria Sawchuk always had a fear of anything medical. I just avoid it, and I avoid dentists, and I avoid doctors, and I avoid hospitals. And medications such as sedatives only made things worse. Because now I am doped up and phobic. But knowing that someday she'd need medical tests, Maria asked her doctor for help controlling her fears, and she found it at the Widener University Biofeedback Clinic. Biofeedback teaches a person how to monitor and control their own responses to stress. Okay, does that feel okay? The first step is an evaluation to determine how you respond. Things like um, increased heart rate, increased breathing rate, our hands often get cold. With the data from the evaluation, therapists develop a plan to help patients become aware of their body's reactions and gently change them. Within a few sessions, most people um, start to start to feel sh some shifts, start to feel some um, positive changes. Maria has been working to slow down her breathing at the sight, sounds, and smells of medicine. Now sh I can smell the alcohol and nothing happens. In addition to controlling fears, studies show various forms of biofeedback can also help with migraine and tension headaches, high blood pressure, chronic pain, sleep problems, and one of the most promising avenues is with attention deficit hyperactivity disorder, or ADHD, in children. Five years out that they were still having um, good changes, that the changes have held. Dr. Pam Calvert-Hertz says biofeedback can be individually and continuously tailored because you can immediately see if it's working. And it has a, another major appeal. You don't have any of the side effects um, that are often present with a lot of the medications. And for Maria, biofeedback therapy worked. She recently needed some blood tests and got through it without a problem. Now the cost of an evaluation is about $80. Each therapy session costs about $50. Most of the time, it's not covered by standard health insurance. Allie Gorman, Channel 6, Action News.